Hello and welcome to Medical Dialogues. I'm Roshni Dhal. Let's look at today's top health highlights. FDA approves oral Dabrodiustan for treating anemia in CKD patients on dialysis. More than a half a million adults in the US have chronic kidney disease requiring dialysis. Kidneys produce a hormone called erythropoietin which signals the body to make red blood cells. In a person with chronic kidney diseases on dialysis, the kidneys cannot produce enough erythropoietin leading to reduced numbers of red blood cells. The US Food and Drug Administration has approved oral Daprodiuse stat for treating anemia in patients with chronic kidney disease who are on dialysis. Just do rock is not approved for patients who are not on dialysis. Other FDA approved treatments for this condition are injected into the blood or under the skin. And Farrell, MD Director of the Division of Non Magnet Hematology in the FDA Center for Drug Evaluation and Research, said this approval demonstrates the FDA's commitment to helping bring a range of therapeutic options to patients with chronic diseases. Patients can consult with their healthcare providers to select the option that is most appropriate. Just do rock increases erythropoietin levels. The effectiveness of Just do rock was established in a randomized study of 2,964 adults receiving dialysis. It is not approved for patients with anemia due to chronic kidney disease who are not on dialysis because its safety has not been established in that population. The most common side effects of just do rock include high blood pressure, thrombotic vascular events, abdominal pain, dizziness and allergic reactions. That's all for today. Stay safe. Never miss a medical update from Medical Dialogues. Like, subscribe and press the bell icon.